Let's see how this matchup is going to queue up. Excited to see back into the classroom. They love this class so much. It must be PE, but the, the one where you don't have to fit, except you fight. All right, goes into the setup. A unique setup right over there. Okay, gets counter hit off of the setup. Goes into the performer. Okay, and it seems like there's interesting mix that can come out of there, summoning the persona. They go up this upward projectile, and she's doing this wiggle room where she's going forward and behind. Very good stuff. And it seems that Akihiko's trying to guard against that. Oh, and he just, Tama just goes up there and did it. That's a good healthy chunk of damage, 20%. Nice stuff from there. What's up, what's up? What's up, what's up? Nice, Koma can get back in the building. It's time to Koma back in the building. Oh, and this says that. Hama's about to lose a round off of the super. That was a very good match you played up there, man. Very stressful stuff. <laughs> yeah, it was. I know. I was, at the end, I was just, okay, I can't, can't press it any happens, buttons man. and then just get, you know, get hit out. So. All right, but uh, as we're seeing, we're about to decide who's your next potential opponent as we're seeing over here. Yeah, this loses to my... Right. Okay. But yeah, Hama, once again, playing uh, Akihiko. I really don't like this, honestly. I told you this, because, right. you know, Minoviki is a better character. Right. If I'm going to do DX, try to kill him, no, it doesn't do. That's so, just the 50%. Yeah, so I guess you see, like, her axe meter, right? Right. So right now it's great. That's, like, the lowest axe level, but she gets axe levels, in, and when she hits with the axe, it builds it up. So right okay, now it's that blue. blue. Yeah. And to do more damage, she does, like, more chip damage on block with the axe normals, things ah, like that. Okay. Then also that super that he did. That converts the axe level into the super um, oh. to do more damage. So, so does, that's why I did so much damage. Does, and then it goes he, back to gray after. I got you. So he surrenders it, but it's an added buff, you know. So right. it's like a damage anchor. Was that what happened when he did that 50%? You know, yeah, off that that's super what happened there, yeah. You. Okay, all right. That's yeah, very so interesting. So it increases yeah. our damage of, like, our axe normal, things like that, and that super, like, increase, uh, increased damage is crazy. So. Very like, trick, you know. Well, look, I mean, he's going to be having the momentum in that sense. Uh, yeah, man, so we did she's go a very momentous character, select, character. Yeah. but yeah, went back to character select, but still Akihiko. Yeah, so. <laughs> Akihiko. I'm very curious to see what this Minazuki is going to be looking like. If no, he ever does, not, I mean, it's it's this is two out of three, so this yeah, is it. Yeah, I got you. This is the last two out of three set we have here. He's committed. He's locked yeah, in. He's locked in. All right, goes into the match. Tries to establish the meaty right over there. There's a button check. You're doing mid match oh, yeah, button check. Yeah, yeah. Looks like, yeah. I guess maybe one of their buttons was incorrect. I don't know. Gotcha. That happens sometimes. You, you know, like, you ever, you ever have that where you, like, you play a whole match with somebody, you know, it goes close. And then um, someone, like, and then they go and check their buttons, and I'm like, man, my yeah. button was messed up. You're like, damn. <laughs> like, it was like that, bro. Like, <laughs> then you get, like, you start sweating. You're like, oh, man. Oh. Yeah, okay. If he was doing that with a messed up button, like, like, like what's going to happen? Yeah, that's the type of thing. Are you good? But maybe there's not, like, a macro. And this game has a ton of macros, if y'all notice. Um, like, like, but well, not macros in the sense of like multiple button presses, right? So to do moves, so like A plus B is one. Okay. Um, that's for throw, and, and then, then like C plus no C plus D is throw. Sorry, I'm thinking melty. A plus B is, dang, what is A plus B? I can't remember now. <laughs> oh, an all out attack. Gotcha. And then the A plus C is like a shit, there's an air turnaround in this game. Oh, okay. Which is cool. So like, like every character has a cross up essentially because you can manually turn around in the air. You need bar. Oh, your your stick. Your stick just died. Okay, it's right there. Yeah, Hama's been having issues with the stick. I remember we were playing that play the other day <laughs> on Persona, and yeah, it just he just stopped moving and just died. He was like, "Yeah, my stick just died." I was like, "Dang, man, you gotta, you gotta get a new one." He was looking for new sticks yesterday, but you know, Kai hasn't come in yet, obviously. So that's happened to me, honestly. Um, in tournament, you know, that's the worst. Having, I went to a North Carolina tournament, uh, maybe like uh, a couple months ago, maybe two or three months ago. It was like, I say two or three, but it was like December, I believe, December gotcha. or November. And um, yeah, during Melty Blood, current code. Um, Cause they had current code, they had type Lumina. And yeah, during current code, it just happened. Like I just couldn't jump anymore. And, but yeah, uh, it was just a middle match. I still played it, you know, after that game, I won. And then I went to get another stick during the next game or whatever. I just couldn't jump. It's Nero. So, like, Nero don't need to jump. Yeah, I don't need to jump. I mean, he has good jump buttons, right. but, you know, you don't need to jump all the time. I got you, but uh, we're jumping back into this match right over here. Okay, jumping back in. Still got Akihiko versus Labras. Okay, cool. Like you were telling me before, starting out at the green axe over here. Okay, then you're just checking buttons again. Oh, okay, yeah. Just Maybe just seeing how it feels, make, make sure everything works. Oh, yeah, we good. Look like it. Ah, there we go. One button was missing. Okay, yeah, I guess this is a uh, air turnaround button. So yeah, uh, this game has air turnaround. It has rolls. There's mm -hmm. rolls. There's short hops, like mm -hmm. I was saying before. There's uh, yeah. 
Yeah, there's uh, short hops, like I was saying before. There's, you know, obviously throws. There's a uh, universal overhead mechanic with armor. Mm -hmm. There's, um, and then what? And then, like, what else? And overhead. Oh, yeah, armor. there's, like, a universal sweep button, you know? Right, right. Like, down A plus B. So there's a lot of, like, button combinations, right? So it, that, that's one of the things. Th this game was meant to be, like, beginner-friendly, but then they have all these button combinations that Man. people need to learn. So it's just like, a little weird, right? <laughs> No, so it's a lot. Not, no, it's a lot. Yeah. Of, like for face value, because of the way that the, you know the persona and like the face buttons work. Right. Like on paper, it looks like that, but because they have so many, like you said, macros, a lot of buttons that combine with other yeah. things. Like you have a treasure trove of options in order to explore yeah. from. You just gotta like have the mind with all to like be invested into the game mm -hmm. and to use it and explore. Right, right. And that's what I think is the recipe for fighting games. Not only that I think are rich and in depth. But for fighting games that I like, I have more questions for you later. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, another one, um, another one is there's universal uppercut uh, in this game. But I feel like those are you know pretty balanced uh, overall, uh, just because punish uh, punishes in this game they, they don't do as much as they used to do. But punish punishes usually is like really high, right? Right. So somebody just you know mashing uppercut like you right, can right. you can be like hey man like you, you need to stop because I, I can hit you with like five k six k combo right, or whatever. Right, so right, right. okay, going back in. The button's probably good. All right, Honestly, uh, I don't know what's going to happen if Hama wins because, you know, he got my stick. But <laughs> he's, like, <laughs> <laughs> he's like, good luck, buddy. <laughs> now, I don't know how you play Because, honestly, if somebody, like, broke their stick, yo. Okay, they're getting some still touching stuff. But That's if somebody cool. broke their stick, man, like, like that that makes you say they didn't ask for yours. That's yeah. already, I'm like, okay, you, how did you break your stick? You yeah, know? yeah. So it's, <laughs> it's like, like, what did you do? Like, right, so now, you know, I don't want that person in your mind or whatever. I mean, Maybe it just happened, you know? It's like, the difference that, between, you know, if something happens, like, hey, like, there's a technical like issue, or the technical issue was the Sam for Kelly issue. If you're surfing, oh, you guys, yeah. you know, out yeah, there, yeah, you know, yeah. <laughs> take a stick, he went, yeet! Just, oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, for sure. You said the Sanford Cali issue. Yeah, yeah man. man. I know Rico knows all about that. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> that was great. I love the memes off that. What's going on? Is he just done? Like, We're going to find out that... in one second. Yeah, what's going on with Hama? So Hama's buttons are, like, registering twice. Every single one. You can know my tip? Yeah, it's usually his thing. I didn't know he was playing. Yo, Hama, are you just done? Like, what's going on? No, I'm going to try to Oh, the buttons are registering twice? Yeah. Even on my stick and everything? Yeah. That's weird. Okay, that's PS4. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, three Okay. I gotta take a piss. All right. I hold now. Hopefully you can come back on though for some commentary. I'm gonna come back. <laughs> <laughs> I have questions about <laughs> Alright, so I gotta restart the PS4. Um the stick on homicide was uh registering the buttons twice. So I don't think it was a stick issue, I think it was just uh PS4 issues, so, you know, just glitching out. Do wonder how long it was happening for. I do know Hama Stick was a little messed up, but maybe it's been working today. You know, it got good days, got bad days. But okay, we, I hear it, I, I hear it going in. Um, so there was a patch on, like, a beta branch on a PC. I don't know if it came on over to PS4. I don't even know there are issues with the PS4 version. Um, but the PC version, you know, had some volume issues, couldn't alt tab out or like just pause the game or whatever, like couldn't unfocus it. Like it was just very, it was weird. Um, But yeah, I think with my matches, I mean, honestly, um, you know, playing Shadow Character, uh, you don't have Awakening, so already, like, all damage is just going to be really high regardless of where your health is. Um, because there's, there's Awakening mode when you're, like, at 30%, I believe it's 30% and below. You go into Awakening, which uh, increases your defense, and also you get a, you get your meter extends. So Shadow characters don't get that. They do get like a thousand more health, but I wonder if everything's good now. Is, uh, looks like everything's good though. Don't know what Hamo was doing before though. 
Okay. Yeah, they look good. All right, going in. Did we get Nakiko still? Yeah. All right, this is uh, this is live. Okay. Yeah, just got a thumbs up. This is live, people. Uh, we ready? Don't know what's going on with the PS4, but hey, we all fine. We, we back now. All right, pick a good song, please. Didn't see what they got, but I think it was good. Ah, man, I'm uh, I'm a little salty still, but we'll go. You know. We shake it off with some commentary. I'm playing the winner of this, I believe. Wait. Oh, so they're just uh, going to restart the set. Uh, I guess Gumi is not going to let that count. Um, so Mission Control score right now is 0-0. Zero, zero. All right. That's it right now. Gumi going in. Dude, I like that uh, Labyrinth Pressure. That's an overhead right there. But that's very hard to punish, so you don't even want to try it, really. Okay, just JB. Battle of JBs. Hama does get an Awakening, but got punished, and that's not going to kill, actually. And didn't even use the Axe Meter, so it may have still done it. All right, so we got everything, uh, got everything working. Nice. Um, they're going to go ahead. I mean, the score says 1-0, but they're going to go ahead and restart the okay. set. Restart so the zero set zero right zero zero. Yeah. That's nice. Uh, fishing up the second that, that, that's over nice. there. Me, well, it's a local. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll do that. But, no, we're you know. good. No, it happens when technical issues. Uh, I bet Hama wishes he could reset that round that happened over there, but unfortunately yeah, that won't be able to happen sure. in that sense. So we're going in. Sitting up on Red Axe right now. What is Red Axe? Yeah, so Red Axe is the highest level. Um, Lavras does like a lot of good chip damage, okay. and also, it, you know, it's just more damage. It's, it's the highest one that does the most that was damage. Nice right now. From that also. So we're gonna get Red in the combo. There we go. Well, you know, but that was a combo. But oh, that was a reset. Oh, there's a block. That the setup. Oh yeah, this guard cancel in that game too. Yeah, so, that's nice. Saw. <laughs> and guard cancel rolls. You can like like tail up. So nice. As we're going for it, tries to put that up with projectile up on the screen from the Persona. Doesn't work out. Sitting on a little hit. Oh, goes for the Lariat. Burst out of there. Yeah, that kill rush, man. That move is great. Yeah, yeah right there, man. It's it, it just like so fast. Like, Hard to oh, no. Oh, they canceled. Blocked, yeah. Um, yeah, maybe may because uh, Akiga could have special cancel and the special cancel, so maybe could have canceled that into uppercut to right. just go through it, you know. Right. But all right. Right now, we're at 1-0. Uh, yeah. Turning back the clock a little. But we're good right now. Uh, Hama trying to find some way to extrapolate a game out of here. Gumi still sitting on momentum before. Yeah. And, okay, goes into the character select, probably just queuing in a little bit of time. What do you think uh, Hama has to do as far as an adjustment like in this round? As far as uh, not picking a different say. character. As far as, <laughs> as, far as that. You right, said right, it right. Right, 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 right. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> Yeah, because he always says, my thing is, too, he's like, Akihiko's so bad. Akihiko's so bad, this and that. Like, yada, yada. Like, and I'm just like, bro, like, like, why you play him? <laughs> like, you think you... Okay, as we're going into it, he's getting pressure from the side. Okay, he claps back with a Navari. Goes for the mix-up. Hurry up. Oh, but the, the guard cancel off the cut. All right, go in there. Nice. All right, they're scrapping where the kitty is at. Okay. Trying to get a little sip and everything. Oh, my nice. goodness. But one thing I'm going to be doing, like I said, reacting to that um, uppercut. So that uppercut has uh, guard cancel frames, right? Right. Well, not guard cancel, but auto block frames. Right. So it's not really invincible. It's just auto block. So you can react to it with your own uppercut right. or with an RC and block it. Ah, gotcha. But something funny about this game is you can um, super cancel uppercuts on block and on hit, obviously. But you can just super cancel them on block and hit. All so. Right. So there's like a time, you know, in winter final, you know, they got the uppercut and I was afraid. I was just like, okay, like, let me just, um, you know, block or that can make Are super. Are super cancels on block relatively safe? No, they're not safe. Oh, uh, well, there you Generally, go. Generally, they're not safe unless they have, like, meter to, you know, oh. cancel that or whatever. Yeah. You can roll through it, whatever, like, the super, so, and punish anyway. So, there's a roll. Oh, nice roll over there. Goes into the other side, gets the hit confirmed, goes into the combo. All right, going to Duff City now. Oh, and this is like the yeah, little uh, pull in, right? Um, dropped it. Dropped that's it. it, yeah. Uh, that's going to cost him the game, unfortunately. Yeah. Going to go around, yeah. 
And and from what I saw from Aki uh, Higo's uh, persona, like he had that little orb over there. Is that yeah. like a pull-in or something? Yeah, like it that? is. It's pretty much like you know gravity or whatever. Got like. you. Okay. That reminds me of like a freaking. I don't know. There's a character that could do that in Take Justice. It? Yeah, well, yeah, that one too. But uh, there was Donatello in Justice too. Oh, I know okay. random yeah, reference yeah, when the yeah, TMNT was yeah, in there. Yeah, yeah. I know that. Yeah. I forgot. I forgot that, that, that those characters were in there. Yeah, in they're Justice. all in there. <laughs> they all play different. Uh, yeah. And every character in this game, you know, they they have a unique play style as well. No, I haven't seen all of them, but I like what I've seen so far. Trying to roll out of it, yeah. to get stuck out of there. Okay, goes into the wall splat. Gets the pressure. Jab, stack or jab. Don't confirm into that though. Oh no, put him in, into awakening. Yeah. Um. So that's something. Oh yeah. So awakening. I was explaining it while you're gone, but you see like uh, how the bar is yellow right now, right? right. And the in the and the meter bar is red. Yeah. So when you get below 30 percent. You enter awakening mode, which increases your defense, and you get 50 meters, and your meter increases by 50 as well. Ooh, and it's only for normal characters, not shadow. I mean, that's just something like that. I see that. So something is, you a lot of times you want to do combos that will bring like that would just kill, not let them get into awakening. Because you get, can't get into awakening during your combo. It has gotcha. to be after when you're in a neutral state. So okay. So that's something you, that you could do, and you don't want to like put somebody like in awakening um, just with chip damage or whatever. But all right, so it's uh, losers finals, I believe. So I'm, I'm up. Here you go. Good luck. <laughs> Unfortunately, right over there, you know, uh, Koma did have to leave over in order to play his losers finals match. Um, he can't bust us with his knowledge, but you're going to see the knowledge being queued on the game screen as these competitors are going to be playing. Uh, but if you guys would like any more Persona 4 Arena Ultimax action, uh, we have plenty of veterans of the scene that have played this game before. Very much hyped for the upcoming update as well.